Hello everyone, I am back again with another cost estimate video for building your house in Nigeria. This time, the cost estimate is for this cute four bedroom house, aka four bedroom duplex in Nigerian palace, which is in fact a detached house. Here's more information about the house. All the four bedrooms are en suite. The house has an entrance porch, ante room, one living room on the ground floor, one dining area, one family lounge on the first floor, one kitchen, one kitchen terrace, one pantry, two sit-outs upstairs, and two visitors' toilets, one on each floor. And here's the total square meters of the house and the equivalent in square foot for those in the USA. As always, if you want the building plan of this house, you will see the link below. And here's everything you will get after purchase. Please read the instructions on that page before purchase. I have building plans of other house configurations available too check them out now a disclaimer please my people i am not a contractor i am not a builder i don't build houses for people because <laughs> the number of emails the sheer amount of emails that i've received since i uploaded my last cost estimate video is alarming i receive emails from people who want me to build their house who want me to do no i, I don't do that please i started uploading cost estimate videos when i was doing the project management of our house in the village this house yeah and i started uploading the, the rest of the videos here on this channel and people started requesting such information from me so these cost estimate videos is just me fulfilling requests from people because you know i have links to people that are involved in the lifetime of building a house from architects to civil engineers to quantity surveyors to uh, contractors, artisans, yeah, people that we have used to build our houses in Nigeria. In this same video, in the description of that video, you will see the contact of all the artisans that we've used, that we, we've worked well with over the years. They are not my employees. Be can read my disclaimer in the description of that video before you hire any of them over the years you guys have shown me that you love 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 how i make these cost estimate videos i will not say no to doing them i'll continue to make them feel free to leave your request below if i receive enough requests for a particular configuration of house i will make a video yes uh, the number of requests need to be worth my time because, you know, I spend a lot of time, I spend a lot of energy, I spend a lot of money before I make these videos. Yes, I pay people to draw the building plan. Contrary to popular belief, <laughs> you need a building plan before you can make a cost estimate video. You cannot pull out all these numbers from thin air. Yeah, you need the measurements to do that. I pay people to do market surveys for me, yes. If you are benefiting from these videos, click the like button to continue to ginger my swagger as I work hard to make these videos for you. As always, the cost estimate in this video is only for the carcass of the building. The skeletal part of the building from the foundation to the roofing. By the time you're done with the cost estimate I'll share in this video, your house will look exactly like what you see on your screen right now. I normally break down the cost in stages. Stages 1, 2, and 3. For stage 1, the foundation and DPC or German floor stage, these are the quantities of building materials you will need. Their unit cost and total cost. I'll give you this spreadsheet for free when you purchase the building plan using the link below. Please note that the type of foundation used for this estimate is normal foundation of a house built in the eastern part of Nigeria and other places where you have this kind of soil. In swamp or coastal areas like Lagos, Portagot, Wari, you cannot use blocks to make the foundation of a building. You will do rings concrete rafts, add rods to your DPC, and these will cost you a lot more money that is not comparable to what you have on the screen right now. To be honest, 
I will say that you should multiply this cost of foundation and DPC by four if you're building in a swamp zone. If you have change, you keep it. But yes, I will set aside 16 million Naira if I were building this type of house in the swamp areas. Remember, this is just a rough estimate. If you need exact quantities, a more accurate estimate for building your house, you should engage the services of your quantity surveyor. Compared to the last time I made a cost estimate video back in July, the price of cement has increased from 7,500 Naira a bag to 9,500 Naira. 10,000 Naira in some places. How much is one bag of cement in your area? I noticed that the prices of rods have decreased the price of granite went from 17,000 Naira per ton in July to an average of 28,000 Naira per ton in October. In Nigeria, how the prices of things increase and decrease does not have any rhyme nor reason. If you can source granite close to your work site, use it during this foundation stage. In my previous cost estimate video, Ademola said that granite is better because it does not contain sand at all, thereby makes a stronger concrete mix. You see what I mean when I say you should be reading comments on this channel? Thanks, Ademola. That gives us a total of 3.8 million Naira for the foundation and DPC stage. And here's the equivalent amount in dollars pounds and euros for those that end in hard currency. Stage two, ground floor side walls and decking. But for ease, I broke it down into two sub stages. Stage two, a ground floor side walls. You have the usual building materials. Please watch my other cost estimate videos to hear some of the nuggets I drop about these building materials. I don't want these videos to be repetitive in nature. Total for this sub stage 2A, 3.8 million Naira with the equivalent amounts in foreign currency, in the major foreign currencies. Stage 2B, stairs, beams and decking. This is where you will spend a lot on cement, rods and planks. 12 mm rods alone cost 2 million naira, planks 1.2 million, while cement costs 1.7 million. Remember that these are rough estimates. So this is the most fierce stage when building the skeletal part of a house. The stage that makes some people run to bungalows. But you'll be surprised to learn that the cost of building a bungalow is not that different from building a one-story building. I have a comparison video on that coming up next. Watch out for it. Everything for this substage comes to a total of 8 million naira. Once again, these are the equivalents in the major currencies using today's exchange rates. Stage 3, first floor side walls, parapet and roofing. But once again, I broke it down into substages for ease. Stage 3A, first floor side walls. At this stage, you should have some planks that you took out from the decking so you can reuse them for the lintels. If the workers took out the planks carefully, you should actually have enough planks to reuse till parapet. Yeah. You may have other leftover materials from previous stages. For instance, you may have some 12 mm rods left over from decking the house. Just keep an eye on your inventory and you will find that you may not need to buy some of the items listed for this stage. Or even if you buy, you may not need to buy the number, you know, up to the number that I listed here. At the end of the day, this is just an estimate, so you should use it as a guide. With all that said, the first floor side walls will cost you 3.6 million naira. For the parapet, the way you will saw the plank depends on the design of the parapet. For the parapet in this building plan, you will need to saw the 1 by 12 by 12 plank into two lengthwise to get 1 by 6 by 12 planks. Total for parapet stage, 2.3 million naira. Yeah, those who earn in foreign currency are balling these days in this floated naira era. Then stage 3C, roofing, another big stage in this carcass of a building business. How much you will spend here depends on the type of roofing sheets you're going for. This estimate is made using the Stone Towns roofing sheets, the most expensive roofing sheets at the moment. This brings us to a total of 6.4 million naira for roofing. And with all that said, we have a grand total of 
28 million naira to build this cute four bedroom detached house four bedroom duplex in nigerian lingo but wait 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 as always let me add my miscellaneous you know the almighty miscellaneous because when building a house you should make provision for the inevitable to avoid surprises let's add five million naira <laughs> or oh, let's make it 3.5 million naira for those when they fear miscellaneous whenever i mention miscellaneous some people start shivering it's still your money like i always say if you don't spend it it will remain in your bank account it's just an estimate for those that have already started building a house based on my cost estimate videos comment below to give me a feedback how close are my cost estimate videos to the, the actual amount you spend on ground when building these houses yeah i know i don't talk about labor and all that but yeah just the materials how close are they comment below to let me know i wish you good luck as you go from stage to stage in building your house if you have not started i wish you good luck as you work hard to save money to build your house remember that you can build your house in safe stages once you take a break at a safe stage nothing will happen to your house so that you can go and prepare again save more money again to come back and continue where you left off yeah and before you know it you're done it's not a race yeah build it at your own pace so that you will not buy before you finish the house don't forget that the link to download the spreadsheet and the building plans are in the description box below see you in my next video